Brian should be free on bail in a few hours, but this is far from over. He committed a Class C felony. What does that actually mean? Maximum 10 years in prison. Minimum suspended sentence of one year. What's your best guess? I really don't know. One month in jail, maybe two. Well, we must know someone on good terms with his judge. No. The belief that we can get away with pulling strings behind the scenes is exactly what got Brian into this position in the first place. Going that route is utter foolishness. Not to mention unprincipled. Not to mention illegal. What about Patrick? He is the Attorney General of New York. Doesn't that count for anything? Patrick's campaign is already so compromised that the slightest whiff of corruption could completely derail it. Patrick has denied you, denounced you, and gotten into bed with Simon Elder, your greatest enemy, and yet he's still more important to you than Brian? Brian committed a felony. Because he loves his son, like fathers are supposed to. Because he is fueled by contempt. Contempt permeates every cell of his being. What is the point of having power and money if we don't use them to help the children? What else are they for? Oh, good grief, Tish, the point. The money compels us to act impeccably. If we start to use our influence, our privilege to pervert justice, that conduct, th that is the beginning of the end of us as a family. As a family. I think we would all be best served by reacting honorably to this situation all of us especially brian and if this were patrick or karen would you be saying the same thing exactly the same what brian needs is our support while well, he spends a month or two in jail <sighs> nick the, the children's hospital proposal 400 million ought to do it yes thank you thank you Is there something going on between you and Tripp? Don't worry about that. Worry about keeping my son out of jail. If your father were alive, he'd know how to handle this. I'd like to be alone. <laughs>